when it comes to the planning. So I, I don't plan anything. I don't plan a single thing in my book. I don't do art journaling because I want to achieve something or create a specific thing. I art journal and I do my journals for the doing. I just want to do. So I don't plan anything. I don't plan colors. I don't plan pages. I don't plan what to do in them. Nothing. Um, I have one journal that I actually do. Um, that I, I had a plan. And that is my Faces of Flow, which is a class where I did faces on every page. So um, I did a face on, on every page in this book um, because faces is something I get a lot of questions about. So I wanted to do a, an art journal with faces and different techniques and so on. So, so I think that's the closest to planning I have ever been in an art journal. Um, I have planned to do a face and I want to show different ways of adding them. So, yeah. So saying I never plan, this is kind of a, uh, what's a plan? And that journal I don't add to either. It's might not be finished, but I don't add to it because it's also a class, actually. So that's, that's a little bit. But other than that, I don't plan. So I just grab stuff like I've shown you in the class. I, I grab something that I want as a cover. I grab um, pages uh, or material for pages and then I sew them together either with the machine or by hand different ways or I glue this one I think I have just glued together so I have several uh, other classes where I show how to do different uh, kind of assemble different kinds of of journals but I put them together and then I just open up and I do something in that page so as you can see here there are no color kind of coordination this is extremely junky it's just a lot of completely different random things here's a face here are some um, it's a some colors a background uh, here is some uh, sewing and some uh, bee wax acoustic here is also acoustic and photos um, so I kind of just do no planning and no coordination um, at all uh, this one uh, is a tiny little one didn't take long to put together in here I have completely different things um, I have some uh, hand stitching uh, I have some uh, journaling writing uh, I have a recipe I have some doodling and and it's just you know it's it's nothing special it's just the doing um, here I have one that I've worked quite a lot in uh, and I just wanted to show how not coordinated this one is either. Um, just to flick through here, are, this is, uh, this is um, a rag. This is uh, watercolor paper, really thick watercolor paper. I got a question about that, how to add it. In this one, I just glued it to a piece of fabric. So I didn't fold and put it in. I actually cut it in two. So you can see it's cut in two and I added it in with, with kind of collage and fabric, the two pieces. Because um, really heavy watercolor paper or any heavy paper can be really hard to fold and get it to work. So here I cut it apart and I glued them in. Um, see, no color coordination, just very different. Yet again, very different. Very different again. So, here you can see, 
no no coordination between the pages not at all so you don't have to do that you don't have to plan you don't have to have a color scheme uh, just open up your book and do something on this particular page that you feel like doing draw a face write something doodle um, do some uh, stitching um, write something in a pattern just splash some paint on it uh, use um, uh, use um, stencils or whatever um, technique you want to use that particular that particular day or that particular um, time here are some that are less I, I think I've have less stuff added to these ones I wanted to show that so here I had quite a lot of stuff added here I have a face here I have some fabric and here nothing is added on here here I started to doodle but I haven't really finished maybe I'll continue or maybe I won't uh, here nothing is kind of added more than some collage maybe this is enough maybe it can be like this or maybe I want to add something else one day here I've added a picture from a magazine and I started to draw on it I didn't finish it um, maybe I will one day, maybe I won't. Um, started to draw. Here I've done some bits and pieces. Here again, a very kind of, I don't know, this might be stuck here. Um, not very finished. Here I've just added some black gesso. Maybe I will add something on this one day, maybe not. So is this finished or is it not? Oh, at the moment I don't feel like I want to add anything to it uh, one day I probably will here's another one very different very different again here I tried to this is uh, also acoustic I love to use acoustic in my journals I won't do that in this class though or show you but you can do it if you here it's crazy look at this it's just crazy it's different patterns it's different things added I've written stuff i i mean there's no kind of uh, there's no um nothing is cohesive nothing is finished it's just a lot of marks a lot of soul a lot of many hours of happy doing I mean, look at this. How different is this to this or to this? Very different. And this, crazy, okay? 